had Everton not dropped 10 points. They would have been above Chelsea when the two teams meet at Goodison Park on Sunday. According to Mauricio Pochettino, that's not much to say. The Toffees got past Newcastle on Thursday. They are the team that not only beat Chelsea 41 a fortnight ago, but also comprehensively dismantled Manchester United before Pochettino's men collapsed at Old Trafford. And they go into the game in great spirits. Sean Dyche has managed to instill some Burnley attitude and play into his squad losing just once and winning three in the last five. Since the start of October it has been six wins. One draw and just two defeats for the Merseysiders. The danger of being dragged into relegation quickly disappeared. This is pretty scary for Chelsea. Especially given their shocking recent record in this fixture. It's a very different style. They can play in different ways. The Chelsea boss said before the match. Always aggressive teams like his personality. Aggressive and brave. We will find a team that will try to press high. Build from the back and also be direct. It's a challenge for us. He added in the face of adversity you can build something special in all areas of the club. It will invigorate and empower everyone to feel part of this unfair decision. We will find a really challenging atmosphere and if you want to perform in the Premier you will have to deal with that in the league. This makes travel and the few days of practice between games even more important for the head coach. Here football. London has selected five PS from the Friday session at Cobham. Reed in Kunku, Lavia, Chiquemica latest Chelsea injury news and Everton return dates read Mauricio Pochettino's final. Chelsea timeline given with clear sacking order Chelsea's ghost has passed the first of the set. Released by the club may surprise many people. Ben Chilwell and Treva Chalaba are center stage in the shot on a sunny Surrey afternoon. Having not been seen for a long time due to injuries. Chalaba hasn't even played yet this season as he picked up a knock in preseason. Chilwell played in opener six weeks before the Carabao Cup final blow against Brighton and has been sidelined for last three months. Pochettino had little to say on the matter either. The days of discussing Chilwell's role in the side appear to be long gone. But having both players available could be a boost for Pochettino. And it's depth. Special day celebrations it looks like Pochettino continues to take Mikhailo Mudrik under his wing. The two have already formed special bond in the hope of a steady improvement in the Ukrainians. Performances and continued understanding of top-level football. The two have documented crossbar challenge battles together and appeared in close conversation during games as they explained their instructions to Mudrik. Here he rests his head on Pochettino's left shoulder during the session. Miguel D'Agostino and Tony Jimenez stand on either side. Almost act. 